obviously come from racing families. How important was it to you that you were going to carry on the family tradition? It was a bribe for me to, to race from my dad. I was in college in Wilmington and uh, never came home. And he said, if you'll come home, you can have your own apartment and you can drive a race car. And I said, okay, I'm in. So I moved back home and there I was. Hey, she was good at driving too. <laughs> we used to race against each other in late models back in my early 20s, but our family did it for fun. It was a Friday or Saturday night thing. Do you remember racing against each other? When was the first time that you did? I think the first time I remember coming to Hickory and racing against Kelly, against Dale Jr. 93, 95, somewhere in, in that time. So it was yeah. neat because so I was an Earnhardt fan. I was like, that is cool. You know, that's, you know, Dale's kids, right? And then once we met, and then it was just, you kind of see how down to earth they all really are. Did you get beat by Kelly? Yeah, I probably did. I think we all did. <laughs> hey, look. Hey, the running thing really? in late models were Kelly was way better than Dale in the late model cars. And we all kind of knew that. They've all said that, that through the years, so I'm, I'm just going with it. The relationship of you two now, obviously, okay, so we talked the background, you guys raced against each other in your, in your teenage years. Now you're working together in a completely different way here at Junior Motorsports. Well, for me, and, and you know, we have the memories of racing together, but um, it just is special when you can do something with people that you like, people that you respect, people that you can appreciate. We've said it all year long, it feels good, it's fun. Joey Logano gets turned. standing in Darlington's victory lane and you're thanking Dale and Kelly how much more special is it because of that family link it's it's hard to put in words because you know I know the chance they took on me to bring me over here and it's like we all used to run around together when we were 20 years <laughs> old who would have thought that, that we could have put all the pieces of the puzzle together to, to make this happen everybody at junior motorsports have made me a kid again give me a great opportunity Dale Jarrett riding shotgun with me today. So uh, I've been wanting to win here for a long time. At this stage in my career, I have a lot of Dale Jarrett, I think, still left in me. His career kind of took off later in life. I was his teammate. Believe me, I know. His fire was still burning week in and week out. And I still have that same fire inside of me. Elliot Sadler will win and advance to the round of eight. You don't lose the ability to drive a race car, you know. And so I had all the faith in the world that Elliot could be a contender and could win. And I, I've laughed with a bunch of people this year. I feel like I've have found the fountain of youth.